Never at ease, I don't know a limit Chasing a dream, I don't know what sleep is I got a queen, she lit me the evening She ripe like a peach and she snapped me the snippet You well overdue for that link up in person Text me to fall through its murder, she wrote it Still up with courage, you're doing a service Pull up to the crib, I'm equipped with the breast strokes Cut throat from the low low when no love goes Women buddy buddy like it's been that When the fuck me looking at the bill stack Off the bubbly buddy, I been stressed out Let the smoke scream from my chest out Niggas laced up, I really hate love from a stranger Shit is fake stuff, only need it from Yo, yeah, crash land in the palm of my hand Bad little flex, wanna play by the coast Carry the torch, I'm way up, it's litty wherever we flow I came from the cold, used to rest on the floor I stitch up my wounds, was born a soldier Flipping the struggle, I'm taking it worldwide Hold it down when you talk to me Say it is what it's supposed to be Say it loud, but I mean it Right guys, welcome back to the channel As you can probably tell by the title of the video down we're gonna be shooting today a full day of eating on my cutting diet so if you're not aware after my last powerlifting competition I decided to lose some weight because I've got my wedding coming up uh, by the end of July and I actually need to fit into the suit we also have our honeymoon coming up mid-August we're gonna head down to Cancun so you know I just didn't want to look like a rhinoceros uh, on my honeymoon so yeah I've decided to lose some weight uh, the plan is to lose about I don't know maybe six kgs in four to six weeks or so I don't know we'll see how I get along and you know how hard I can actually push uh, the cut but anyways this video will take you along on what does a full day of eating for me looks like on my new cutting diet so in short I'm doing 35,000 calories on training days lucky for me and lucky for you today is a training day and then I'm doing 3,000 calories on my non training days so those are a little bit more boring and less appealing to see so I'm gonna bring you along today and hopefully I can share some good tips and hacks uh, on how to stay on track and how to make a diet not very difficult and a very painful if you're not already subscribed to the channel guys please do subscribe uh, it really helps the channel grow drinking water and having coffee or any caffeinated drink without calories uh, really helps you kind of not get hungry during the morning so as long as you don't eat anything and you don't spike your insulin and yes protein does spike insulin caffeine is an appetite suppressant so don't abuse it but you know just make sure you drink some caffeinated drink preferably black coffee with uh, some sweetener in it as soon as I finish my coffee and I've done about two to three hours of work replying to emails and doing whatever I need to do at work I'll usually go out for a quick short walk usually for about 15 to 20 minutes just uh, around the block just to get the steps in I'm not doing any cardio yet and I don't think I will do any cardio during this cut I really don't fancy cardio and I don't feel like doing it this cut so what I usually do to kind of keep my my steps up I'm usually aiming for about 10,000 steps every day I usually go for this morning 15 minute walk then I'll go out again after the gym with Anna when she's back from work and we've trained we'll go for another probably 30 to 40 minute walk and that usually adds up to about 10 to 12,000 steps so that's my goal Right, so it's now 12 a.m., 12.05. I did a little bit of more work and now I'm gonna have my first meal. So this is my breakfast. I've got here two whole eggs and 300 grams of egg whites. Then on the inside we have um, three ham slices and somewhere around, I don't know if, yeah, there we got uh, two uh, cheese slices, uh, American style cheese, you know, the, the plastic one. And then we got here 300 grams of veggies, which is probably a bit too much, but anyways, however you're able to get your veggies in, just make sure you get them in throughout the day. I won't be eating any more veggies on this day. I've already kind of input my meals into my fitness pal, so I already know what I'm gonna eat, and there's no more veggies during the day, so I'd rather go high at least on this meal that I'm gonna have veggies. As you can see, minimal carbs. Reason being that 
Just like fasting, I like to push my carbs either further into the evening or around my workout. Just to give it a little bit of flavor, I will add some of this lighter than light mayo. It only has 10 calories per tablespoon, so it's virtually nothing. I don't even count it, at least not at this stage. And to be honest, I'm not gonna count it at any point in my diet because I'm not gonna get extremely shredded like a bodybuilder. I just wanna lose some weight. So I don't, I, I, you know, I, I just don't wanna stress too much about counting sugar-free sauces and low-cal sauces. So this is also a non-sugar added ketchup, just to give a little more flavor to the omelet. And that's it. Oh, and I almost forgot. A little bit of sriracha on top, spicy foods or spicy sauces. Uh, they will help you to kind of feel more satiated. I don't know why, but spicy food kind of makes you feel more full. That's it, meal number one. Now I'm gonna sit down and I'm gonna eat this while I work a little bit more. That was close. One way to kind of keep you full is also to drink uh, fizzy drinks, sugar-free sodas or soft drinks. They kind of help me satisfy my sweet tooth and also they keep me full because you are still consuming a lot of liquid, a lot of water and fizzy drinks fill up your stomach quickly. Feel free to drink any, any soft drinks that you like just as long as they're sugar-free and zero calories. There are some myths around um, sweeteners giving you cancer and sweeteners spiking insulin and making you fat. Just with a very quick research, you'll find out that that is just BS. Talk that good when you talk to me. Say a nice and I give it to you. You know my word is fun, yeah. What we on now is wild shit. Of right. So I'm gonna have now meal number two. This is my first carb meal, you can say. It's just purely carb and fats. There's no protein here, really. Uh, this is my pre workout meal. So it's now 3.20. PM. Uh, it's a little bit late. I usually like to have this at 2:45 or 3 p.m. at the latest, because I'm gonna train at five. So that allows me like a, one hour and a half or two hours to digest this meal. Uh, so this is pre-workout meal. I'm gonna have this with uh, coffee. I'm gonna add just a tiny bit of milk to the coffee. I'm not counting it because it's just a very small amount. This is skim the milk so no fat or minimal fat and anyways for this uh, I'm having two English muffins and then one bagel thing because bagel thing has a few less calories than the um, muffins so that way I can have more food and enjoy a bigger meal with le less calories and also another thing with this meal is I use instead of using regular butter I use this um, light whatever this is i think this is just like infused oils or whatever it tastes it doesn't taste as good as butter but it does give it a nice taste to the meal and also with the jam i like to go with this uh bone mama intense it actually has less calories and less carbs than regular marmalade uh this is the same brand just uh, this one is like with added sugars and this one is without added sugars and by 100 grams this one has 39 grams of carbs versus this one that has 60 so you can see the difference per 100 grams this way you can still have your strawberry jam or your jam and enjoy it with less calories less carbs that way you're able to eat more so now i'm just gonna enjoy this i'll give you just one bite and then i'll sit down to do a little bit of more work i have till about five it's been almost an hour this is my last meal. Uh, I'm not gonna prepare my intra workout drink. I'm gonna start with EAAs, one scoop. One scoop of, glutam of glutamine. One scoop of creatine. Three scoops of intra HD. And now one scoop of uh, carb HD, which is branched cyclic dextrin. These are the best source of carbs for intra workout. They require a minimal blood flow into the stomach for digestion and digestion is almost immediately, which means as you sip on your intra workout, your carbs will be turned into glycogen and be directed to your muscle 
that quick and of course you'll be able to use them during your workout. Make sure you check out hdmuscle.com for all these supplements and more. They also have a very nice line of apparel. Use code IB10 to save you some money and support me. Now for the most important meal of the day, my post-workout meal, I'm gonna have 200 grams of cereal. 350 milliliters of milk. This is skim milk, by the way. Now I'm gonna enjoy this. How they got this and how they got that? Too busy watching this thing, you need to stop that. Talking my shit, you know we gonna pop that. See it out. We're now gonna get ready to do the evening walk with Anna. She just got back from the gym. She's probably having something to eat and then we'll, have, we'll head out for our 30 to 40 minute walk. Time to have dinner now. Um, so usually for dinner um, I have two different options. When I'm cutting I either have a small dinner like this one. This is very small for me. I'm used to have huge dinners. So I usually have two options. Have a small dinner and then have a big dessert or vice versa I just have a huge dinner and not have dessert it depends on how I feel that day and if I know I'm gonna be craving things before going to bed then I'll usually have a small dinner and then a huge dessert which uh, the one I'm gonna have today sits very heavy on the stomach so I know I won't have the the need you know to get up from the sofa and start snacking on chocolates or whatever here we have 90 grams of, uh, of fries these fries are cooked in the What's his name? Air. In the air fryer. So, you know, they have less fat than deep fried fries. And here we also have... <laughs> that's it. We have a, a chicken scallop. So this is one full piece chicken scallop. I just cut it in half, add a cheese and a bagel thin because that way I save some calories on the carbs with a bagel thin. The sauce is same as this morning. I don't count them because I just use way too little and you know it doesn't add up in my calories and they are low sugar, low calories, so I'm not worried about that. I just wanna look good for Cancun. <laughs> I also need to fit into my wedding suit. Yeah, please. Which is most <laughs> the most important thing. So yeah, I'm not worried about you know losing way too much fat. I just wanna look good for the pictures, <laughs> right honey? <laughs> You're right, right now. Anna makes this incredible <laughs> um, garlic mayonnaise. We'll have to ask her for the recipe. But she usually makes this with the low calorie mayonnaise, so we don't count this as well. And it tastes incredible. My camera's running out of battery. So anyways, I'll just eat this until the camera runs out of battery. And then I'll change the battery and I'll see you guys in the last meal. <laughs> So this is what I was mentioning that this sits very heavy in the stomach and there's something about this meal, I don't know what it is, I think it's between the protein and the yogurt, kind of, it, you know, it falls like a rock in the stomach and 
it really kills any craving or any appetite that I might have left. So here we have 500 grams of zero fat fudge, fudge, I don't know how you pronounce it, yogurt, Greek style yogurt, zero fat. And then I added two scoops of Pro HD um, muff, uh, blueberry muffin flavor. That's about 60 grams of protein uh, powder. Then I've got two Fiber One chocolate brownies. These are these ones, which are 90 calories each. They have a lot of fiber, so they really help you also uh, kind of feel full. 200 grams of frozen berries in there. And then I just drizzled on top a little bit of Walden Farms low calorie or zero, zero calorie syrup. So I'm gonna enjoy this while we watch a movie on Netflix. What movies are good on Netflix at the moment? Mm. Also the berries, they need to be frozen. It gives it a completely different texture and, and flavor. Oh, I also sprinkled a little bit of uh, pink Himalayan salt on top. Good morning. Today is actually the day after of the full day of eating. Today is actually a non-training day. So as I said before, you know, my calories will be a little bit lower today. You don't need to do this, but I find it very useful for me to have higher calorie days on the days that I train uh, because I'm a power lifter. So it really helps me push through the heavy workouts. And then on non-training days, I'm perfectly fine, you know, eating less food, 3000 calories today. What I usually do today is I will increase my fat, I will increase my protein to kind of keep me satiated and fats, you know, will help with kind of a hormonal production and protein, of course, will help with recovery and, and, and building muscle on my rest day. Then I'll bring carbs down to, I don't know the number, just wherever it takes me to, you know, to reduce 500 calories or to get at 3000 calories for the day. I will try to push my first meal a little bit farther down so today I'm planning on having my first meal probably around 1 p.m. instead of 11 something or 12. So yeah, I think that's everything for the video, guys. I'll probably do another video if I lower down my calories a little bit more, which I think I will. The only thing is that when I should be reducing my calories farther down, I will probably be in Spain for my wedding. So that's gonna be hard to kind of keep you know, track of foods or to cook at home. But what I'll do is, um, as soon as I'm back from Spain, that last 10 days before going to Cancun, I'll be shooting a new full day of eating, you know, cutting diet with even lower calories than this video. So if you're still watching the video, I do really appreciate your support. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and also drop the video like if you enjoyed it. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one.